Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Moat. So freaking happy to be here with you guys today. Um, we're going to have face cam tomorrow. I got all these uh, little foam things to hang up on my walls and whatnot, so uh, that's why there's no face cam right now. But hey, at least you still get to hear my voice, right? That's right. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed that police video that I posted. It seems like you guys did, which makes me super happy because I love doing that kind of stuff. I love just telling stories. It's a lot of fun for me. But Today, as you can see, we are on our Town Hall 8, guys, of course. I mean, what else would it be, right? This is my new favorite account. I like it so much more than my Town Hall 10. Um, we have got almost 42,000 Dark Elixir, guys. We've got four days and 20 hours to get that other 18,000 Dark Elixir, all right? So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys a couple of replays because look at this one right here. I got 2,100 Dark Elixir from one raid on a Town Hall 8. And it was freaking beastly because I got an extra 200 from that loot bonus, which is 2300 Dark Elixir. Let's go ahead and watch this bad boy and see how we did. And look at this. It was with freaking Barch. So I'm going to lightning spell that mortar. You guys know how it is. I haven't used Barch in so long. I used to always say Barch is love, Barch is life. It still is, but not when you're trophy pushing. <laughs> um, but thankfully, I was still able to get some stars on this one as well as that Dark Elixir. But look at all of the loot that Mr. or Mrs. Silvana from Black Devil 14 has. They're a level 3 clan, which is surprising that there's nothing in that clan castle. There goes a giant bomb, but we're dropping in our troops. We're going to drop our king off over here. Everybody and their brother is going in here towards this Tesla, which is under construction. Same with that mortar right there. Same with that air defense. So much of his base is under construction right now. Um, so I knew that this would not be a problem. We're going to drop off that heal spell, guys, and it is going to uh, keep all of our... Uh, folks alive as this mortar starts focusing them. So that's why I dropped it down because I knew that they would be in range of that mortar. Archers are taking out that dark elixir for me. Easy peasy. We've already gotten over to, yes, I did just say easy peasy. <laughs> so we've already gotten 2,100. The last of the dark elixir is right here. Um, but I'm not too worried about that because right now we're getting our elixir, which is going to help us with our Elunian, which we do love so much, which we're going to have a raid right after this with some of that. But guys, this was an epic uh, barch. It really was an epic barch. We got two stars. We got our king up in here. We're going to town. We're doing work. No problems whatsoever. We can go ahead and fast forward. We got about 15 seconds left. Fly through this thing. We end up at 63%. Two stars, 10 trophies, 300,000 elixir, and 2,100 dark elixir. Yes, please. That is exactly what I'm looking for. Let's go ahead and look at this next one right here, guys, where we got another good amount of Dark Elixir from another Town Hall 8. And this guy's upgraded fairly well, actually. I think he might be, uh, he might be max, besides his walls, obviously. His defenses definitely are. Um, but obviously we can't see his Teslas or anything like that. But we're going to go ahead and drop off our loons. We're only going to use one spell because that's all we have. As you guys know, I am in impatient. So if I have troops ready and only one spell, I'm not waiting on my other spells because that's boring to me. I want to go ahead and just get it over with. Uh, and so sometimes it ends up biting me in the butt, but other times it's fine because as you can see right here, we're taking out uh, their king, all this kind of jazz. We've only gotten 27%, but that's okay because there's almost 1,300 Dark Elixir just sitting right there ready for my minions to come in and take out. Now, these ones are within range of the air defense but the other ones right next to them are not so that's just free it's just free thank you very very j-rod is this j-rod is this his town hall eight does he have a town hall eight i just freaking looked at that <laughs> guys i've got absolutely no idea if this is his base or not i didn't even recognize i literally just saw that if you guys don't know who j-rod is j-rod 12399 go check him out he's been uh doing uh <laughs> clash videos for longer than i have but, as you can see, we've got, uh, we're about to get 50%, and we're about to get that town hall with, is that just one minion? No, we got two little minions, they're tag teaming it, tag teaming it, woo! There we go. But, we got all the dark elixir, zero left for Mr. J-Rod, oh my gosh, I wonder if this is him or if this is a fanboy. Um, I've never attacked another molt, that would be interesting. Have you guys ever seen molts that aren't me, like another molt? That'd be super, super interesting. Uh, to know. So there we go. Little minion gonna finish it up for us. 20 seconds, guys. That was two raids in a row where we got a total of almost 4,000 Dark Elixir. Those are the kinds of raids that I need, and I need them now because I'm trying to upgrade my freaking 
golems. I'm not going to mess with my Valkyries. Everybody, seriously, so many people voted for Town Hall 9. It's ridiculous how many people voted for Town Hall 9. It's absolutely absurd. But we're going to go ahead and attack. And let's attack the first base that we see. Nope. Not enough Dark Elixir. Uh, <laughs> hopefully we can find one fairly soon with a good amount of Dark Elixir. And then I will be back with you guys in just a couple. Oh my goodness. Yes. Yes. <laughs> this is exactly what I'm looking for. Alright, so we're going to attack from the bottom down here. We're going to go ahead spread out our loons just like that. We're going to do one and one, and then we might... Where do we want to drop our heal spell? Because that is going to be very, very important for us. Uh, but that wizard tower isn't too high of a level. As long as they get up in there, I'm perfectly fine with this. Oh, no, he does have clan castle troops. So we're going to keep on working our way around. We're just going to drop that heal spell right here, and they're going to work their way through it. Uh, we'll go ahead and drop off our king as well. He'll head in there. And uh, there they go. Look at that. They are just hanging out in that heal spell, guys. I feel like we might be able to three-star this. Um, I feel. Oh, no. Our loons are going too slow now. And those, uh, those freaking archers are chasing them. Archers, come and chase a minion. Come chase a minion, archer. Come and chase a minion. All right, we're going to send. There we go. We're going to send our, uh, our minions up in there towards that elixir storage. And then they'll head over towards the dark elixir as long as... Come on, take it out. Oh, no, that wizard tower is going to end up killing him, but we will definitely take out the air defense. Nice, there we go. So our king's still alive. Nothing really is going to mess with him. There they go. They are on that dark elixir for us now. That is exactly what I want to happen. Here we go. Let's see. Here it is, the epic battle of clan council troops versus minions. They're going to head over here. Hopefully our minions will switch over to them and stop shooting the gold. Come on, minions, take them out. Take them out. I don't want to mess with this. I don't want to deal with them. Um, our king is breaking through a wall, which is exactly what we actually do want him to do because that's going to be the last defense. That is going to be the last defense. We're not going to use his ability yet because the wizard tower is going to take out his barbarians. Uh, right now, the wizard tower is not doing that much to him as a uh, AOE type uh, defense messing with a single unit. So we're going to get up in there. Boom. Here we go. Now we're going to use it. Take it out. One and two. Get the freak out of here. King's coming in. Our king's going to work his way in. What is he doing? Come on, take him out. Our king's going to go down probably. Nice. Look at that, guys. That, hey, you guys just saw me live search, live find this thing, and absolutely dominate this guy. Three stars on Mr. Ghost Panthers. Clear out. Why are we clearing out? Oh, I'll tell you what's clearing out. I'm clearing out your base, son. Taking all of his loot. Look at that. We're almost up to 44,000 Dark Elixir now. That is exactly what I wanted. 23 trophies from this. Come on, let's get it 99%. Here they go. They're heading in there. King's not even going to get a tap on it. Oh, he's like, guys, guys. Look at that, guys. 249,000 gold to give away for free. 187,000 Elixir and 1,840. Actually, no, 2,000 Dark Elixir with that bonus. That's what I'm freaking talking about. That's what I'm talking about. 44,000. Nice. We're at exactly 2,200. We'll go ahead and train those bad boys up again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But guys, I want to thank y'all so much for y'all's support. I know I said that every video, but that's because every video I want to thank y'all for your support. <laughs> for those of you that are still here watching at the end of videos, you guys are the true freaking Molt followers. If that's you, if you're still watching, comment down below and say, I'm a true Molt fan, all right? Because it's you guys... And, I mean, everybody else who watches as well, that means a lot to me. But you guys take your time out to watch 100% of every video, and that's just freaking awesome. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you all hit that like button for me, guys. Let's see if we can get, I don't know, seven likes or something like that. That would be pretty cool. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you find my base, come and snag my gold. Obviously, you want to attack from right over here so you don't have to deal with these traps. You guys have a little in because you know what's going on. But that's going to be it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. And as always, what are we going to do? You know exactly what we're going to do. We're going to keep calm, and we're going to freaking clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.